Hello guys, I'm Yowzer, welcome back to the channel for another Path of Exile video. This one is going to be a continuation of the video I did yesterday, or well, maybe it's the day before yesterday, I don't know when this one is going up, I'm just recording it, it's gonna take a while to record this video. We are going to run 10 monstrous treasure prophecies and check out what the total loot is going to be. The total investment for this was I bought um, about 80 scarabs for about 1c each, which is 80c. And I bought the 10 monstrous treasures in bulk, so I paid a little bit more and I paid 12c each for them. So this is a total investment of 200 chaos. We're going to see how much we're going to come up with in the end. I'm going to stash everything into two small stash tabs. I'm going to sell all the 6 link, all the 6 sockets, and just see how much currency we will come up with in the end. I am going to show every big drop and stuff like that in the video. I'm not sure if I'm going to do commentary on that, so it's probably going to be like a fast slideshow, so to say, of short clips, which are like the six link drops and all the big drops, like if we get an exalt or whatever. Um, I'll put that all in and we'll check out the huge profits at the end, so enjoy. So as you can see, we have our 10 monstrous treasures right here. I have 79 polished ambush scarabs right here, which should be enough. I am also going to include the loot from maps that are not going to run the Monstrous Prophecy because you will not get the Monstrous Prophecy on every single map that we run. Um, we're going to have like a map or two in between that doesn't activate the Prophecy, but I'm still running it with the Scarab and with the Ambush map craft effect. So we're still going to get a lot of strong boxes even if we don't do the prophecy itself we're still going to get like about eight or nine strong boxes in the map which also have a chance to drop a six link well we got a divine orb from a ritual so i'm taking that I mean, that's not like super super lucky, so I'll take it. Alright, we're at the halfway point. This is the currency that we have so far. These are the maps that we've gotten dropped so far. These are the items that we've gotten dropped so far. These are the prophecies that we still have to do. And these are our diff cards and our quality gems, which we, in the end, will sell off for um, gem cutters prisms. I might have to do it a little bit sooner because we're running out of room on the stash tab. Um, we are getting like a lot of sets over here, like the void, cartographer's chisel, all that kind of stuff. That we can turn in the end and have like a little bonus of the video maybe we'll get some good rng there we'll see so yeah on to the second half the saint's treasure nice an exalt we got an exalt Got another Saint's treasure. And we got an exalt. Alright, we have finished the 10 prophecies. Now, I started with the 10 prophecies and 79 scarabs, I think it was. Um, let's see how many we have left. We have 45 scarabs left, so we used about 34 scarabs. That means we ran 34 maps in total, which is 1 in 3 being a prophecy. Um, I did accumulate all the wealth that we got from the maps where the prophecies didn't run because it comes up with a more accurate reading when you guys do this yourself so this is all the currency that we got 
it's a lot, I know. We had two X drops, which is amazing. Absolutely amazing. We got a button of jeweler orbs. We've got 19 divines, almost 50 chaos right here. Um, I did pick up all the wisdom and portal scrolls because newer players do this. Even though it's a waste of time, I cannot recommend you doing this. You are going to run them way faster if you don't pick up all these scrolls. Um, I did end up spending about seven hours to do this so yeah let's see this is partially i had to make another tap for maps this is some of the maps this is the rest of the maps yes we got a lot of map drops these are all the item drops now um some of these are pretty crappy some of these are pretty good we got a harbinger map um we got some other unique maps we got a lot of um contracts for um heist we got some uniques, we got some essences from random essences that were there. We got some fossils here from um, the rituals. And some unique items that are pretty crappy. This one's like 5C or something. And then we have all the div cards. Now I want to open these up at the end of the video. Um, let's see what we get from that. So now for the total profit that we got. This is all the profit not including maps, items, and diff cards. We've got 695 chaos total with a 200 chaos investment that makes for 495 chaos profit, which is about 5x. Now, if we take into account all the maps that we got, we've got 275 chaos in profit in all the maps that we've gotten. That's another two and a half to three x right there. So the total altogether profit is 770 chaos, which is about 8 exalts. So if you want to know if it's worth it, there you go. About 8 exalts. Took about 7 hours to run. I did not put the diff cards in there. So we, we got like, where is it? Like I think here, yeah. We got 4 Saints Treasures cards, which is almost another exalt. So you can count that up and all the other diff cards with it. So yeah. A lot of profit from these prophecies. If you like the video, hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, you want to see more PoE stuff. I'm gonna be doing some gambling videos in the future as well, um, valing some like unique items, see if we can get some mass profit from that. If you'd like to see that, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Until then, stay safe, make a lot of exalts, and until then, have a great day. Bye bye.